the people who are responsible for a network, for example the network engineers, should have their contact information in the right database. This information will be stored in person objects. Let's see how you can create a person object. Go to ripe.net and select Web Updates. Choose Person from the list of object types. Log in with your RipeNCC Access account. All maintainers already linked to your RipeNCC Access account will be automatically selected to protect your person object. You may choose to remove any of them by clicking on the X. Enter your name, your address, and your phone number. The nick handle is a unique identifier for the person object. Leave the keyword auto-1 and the ripe database will create one for you. The source is ripe because we are creating the object in the ripe database. Click Submit. Done. You now have a new person object. Please remember your nick handle. You will need it when you want to point any other object to your person object. What can you do with this person object? If you are the contact person for your network, then the ripe database objects representing your network must point to your person object. If you are an administrative contact for the network, then the nick handle of the person object should go in the admin C attribute. If you are responsible for handling technical issues, then the nick handle should go in the tech C attribute. Is there more than one person responsible for a network? Then it is good practice to use a role object. See our video How to Create a Role Object in the Ripe Database. To know more about how maintainers work, see the video Protecting your objects in the Ripe Database. And don't forget to keep your contact information up to date in the Ripe Database.